Hello, dear friend. Now you can see we just finished the testing of this uh, QT4 series uh, for the block machine. It produces 16 inches hollow blocks. Now the blocks is fresh. It's fresh. We just uh, produce the blocks immediately from the machine. Now we try to go up and test the blocks. Whether it can support a human body. I try to. Oh, beer, beer. Whoa. Uh, very strong blocks. Look at, look at my whole body and set up on the blocks, and it can support my body. My, my, my weight is uh, 70, 70 kilograms. Okay. Let me huh? mm. okay. And try to look at what I stand, stand here. Stand here. Mm -hmm. Stand here. It's no crack. Okay. Hello, dear friend. Oh, welcome to watch my videos. This is from uh, Henry Intelligent Block Machine Company. And today we try to test uh, this fully automatic hydraulic block machine for our Guyana, Guyana, Guyana customer who order this particular fully automatic concrete block machine. Now we just finished the testing for the blocks. This one is six inches. It can mold uh, five, one, two, three, four, five, five pieces of the six inches hollow blocks. And I want to describe these uh, hollow blocks a little different from the normal side, normal, uh, normal blocks. You look, you look at here, it's the groove. The groove is required, is required by our bias, like a little, you know, circle, see? Uh, yeah, and also look at uh, the, the blocks and the side surface uh, density is very strong. The compression is good. And somebody will ask whether, you know, Oh, how, how these blocks looks like here? It's because the material is not enough. You know why or it's feeding? It's feeding the car feeding uh, the mold, the mold area. So here, this, this area, the, the material is lack. That's why it's formed the blocks like this. Uh, I want to show you this block machine because now this block machine hasn't been finished uh, painting you know it's just uh, the bottom bottom painting bottom color so after after texting we will try to finish uh, complete uh, complete the painting to be the blue color or yellow color and any colors you like but i want to show you the the real the real bottom color of the machine so look at the steel these parts for the cut, for the material cut, go forward and go back. It need, uh, how to see, very uh, strong and very solid to support uh, the material cut to go on. So this one is, uh, is made by the heat treatment technology. So you can feel um, this part of the steel is a little black, right? It's a little black compared with this part. So it's more stronger. And look at our welder. It's very nice and very professional. See the welder parts. It's very, you know, uh, correct and detailed. Everything is very strong. Look at this. Very thick. The welder parts is very thick and hard. Here, look at here. It's hard and thick. Uh, look at this. You know why we designed this spring? The spring, screw the spring uh, onto the hair, uh, onto this uh, gear, the gear and bearing. Uh, because the material cut forward, go forward, and this one will be give the space to, you know, to, uh, to spring it. So it uh, will be given uh, enough space for the machine to get so that 
uh, it can reduce uh, the wearing between these parts and this iron rod. Okay, my friend, now we try to, after producing the blocks, and we will according to, uh, and we will measure, we will measure the size of each blocks. 400, 400 millimeter. This one is 150. 150, 150 millimeter means uh, six inches. Okay, according to this, according to, you know, according to the drawing pictures, here the drawing picture is what we confirmed uh, with the customer be, before, uh, no, 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 uh, be, uh, how to say, uh, before we pro uh, start production. So, we will take uh, all of the responsibility of each blocks we produce and uh, confirm the mode of the blocks is correct uh, as you want. And now we take the photo. Okay.